you know, I look at my CMEC file save, and I'm still dreading the fact that Naoya is only level 77, and I still have to get even higher. Oh my god, that's gonna take forever. But anyway, hello everyone, and welcome back to Shin Megami Tensei Persona. The last episode, well, we did Hypno's Tower, but... E Let's just say these two are kind of doing the thing now. Because dreams apparently transcend reality and stuff. I don't know. All I know is we have one tower left. We have... How many shards do we have? Oh. We have nine mirror shards. And this is the big one. After this tower determines our ending. If you have more than eight shards, you literally cannot possibly get the bad ending now. I mean, the only realistic way to get the bad ending is to literally not get any shards from Thanatos Tower. Well, from Tartarus. But all we have left is Nemesis Tower, which is the middle ground tower. So, fill it on, take it away. This is the entrance to Nemesis Tower. This tower is a complex structure, as well as a cruel, calculating master. Brace yourselves if you intend to proceed. Yeah, tower, yeah, tower, okay. So, the only one left is the middle ground tower. And we are so ridiculously overpowered that we will probably have zero trouble. Anyway, there is a gimmick with this tower, unlike how Hypnos Tower pretty much had no gimmick. But we'll get to that shortly. For now, a deep, resounding howl can be heard from beyond the door. Let's go to Nemesis Tower. So right away, we go to a room. It feels weird in here, like someone's giving me a nasty look. <laughs> Good day to you all! It's a delight to see you here in this tower! Allow me to extend a warm welcome! <laughs> oh my god. Who are you? Show yourself! I assume you're the guardian of this tower. Can't you even- can you even- even before us? Huh, I suppose there's something you've done for it call yourself a guardian, but you're powerless without the Snow Queen. Yeah, you heard that. You're scared of us, aren't you? <laughs> hey guys, this tower's boss seems like totally weak, huh? Lucky us! Oh, up. Here they come. <laughs> what a litter of witless yapping whelps you are! For it's all to the good. I think you can keep me entertained for a while. Weak playmates fall so easily, I rarely get to enjoy my sport. <laughs> I haven't introduced myself, have I? My deepest apologies. I am the Stokely's faithful servant, the guardian of Nemesis Tower. Mitchell, oh my god, what is that last name? Matsudaira? Yeah, we're just gonna call her Michiko. I hope you grasp the honor of dying by my hand. Incidentally, hmm? you, yes, you. Oh, what a pleasant surprise. Such a fine, handsome gentleman. I'll spare your life if you become my pet. What say you? Oh god. Uh, what? Me? W wait a second, what the hell? Who do you think you are, ugly? Come on out of nowhere saying that stuff. Who think that I, the magnificent brown, would stoop to be your pet? Cause I ain't funny, damn it. I'm gonna beat the crap out of you. I'll take the ugly face and make you uglier. <gasps> this is outrageous. I take pity on you. You bite back in response. <laughs> I suppose you commoners can never understand my greatness. Very well, now I'll execute each of you whilst myself. The time to on this tower is hereby lifted. What? Take all the time you want. Come to me no matter what it takes. Once more, take as much time as you want. I look forward to seeing you. Until then, farewell. Bitch, ho, Matsudaira. Looks like she won't go down easy. Yeah, you heard that right. The restriction on the time is gone. 
How is it something else? The best for us to hurry, even with that strict time limit to observe. No time limit? From the way she was acting, there's gotta be a catch. Don't you think? She's so egotistical, it's like she was born that way! She asks that she's better than in the whole world! This we need you and me, she's a lot like our very own Mr. N. <laughs> that integral girl totally reminds me of someone. Do you know how she's like super arrogant? Okay, so it's time to talk about this tower's gimmick. The time limit is actually removed. We don't need to worry about the timer. Although, depending on how long you take to get through this tower, it will affect the boss of this ice. It only counts when walking on the map. Not this first per not the battles, menuing, or the map. They just first person walking. So literally, if you get caught in encounters and stuff, you don't need to worry. The real problem here is there is a mirror shard in this tower that will require us to go out of our way for. I'm just gonna mudo this archangel real quick. And eternal black everything else. And Bufua, you, I guess. And Agi, you. And. It's a good thing we have other skills. Wow, okay, those two just died immediately. Goodbye, Angel. Rank 5. And got Stone Claw. Stun Claw. Alright, weapons go. Okay, we got a useless item because we don't have Maki. But yeah, first war is pretty straightforward. Uh, I'm pretty sure we can just auto this fight to... Pretty sure all these guys can get blasted. Well, actually, I don't want Naoya to blast everything. I need to get experience on everyone else, so we're going to avoid using him to literally shredify everything for a little while. I mean, yeah, he's gonna mess out on experience, but, you know, it doesn't really matter that much. I'm gonna have to farm no matter what, so... Okay, wow, this path is incredibly straightforward. But yeah, all we do is just auto everything. Because if Yukio doesn't kill everything, oh, he's going to kill everything. I mean, I need to get levels of both of them anyway. Uh, well, let's go to southwest. This way. Okay, wow, look at this fight. Literally free real estate. Free! Fights! Ladies and gentlemen, Ellie getting all the experience, good. She needs it. Alright, right off the bat, we got shops. Okay. This one is, boy, begging me to wear it. It's true, some clothes are only worthy of a handsome man. Oh god! <laughs> I didn't go through the dialogue in Hypnos Tower, so I'm kind of, I'm kind of sad that I didn't bother coming into the shops. What? Okay, hi. We don't need anything here because we have the Thanatos Tower equipment, which is much better than everything that's sold here. Besides, we need to save our money for bigger, better equipment. Oh my god, can I please? So what's this shop? This is just guns, right? Wait, what are you doing here? According to my investigation, aliens are behind this school freezing phenomenon. Have you been abducted by any UFOs in the last two or three days? No, but the hospital got, got attacked by demons. What's with that little arms doing at school? Why well, got part of that small stuff you're not supposed to sweat? Oh gosh. I mean, yeah, that's a good point. Why do all these dudes have the exact same face? Even though we literally don't need to buy any of this trunk. I, if you sold, like, actual weapons and not just guns, which is a thing I've always wondered, why is it that we cannot buy weapons but we can buy guns? 
Yeah, give a bunch of teenagers firearms, but oh my god, no. Go away. Okay. Goodbye. I still don't like Hanako. I've had bad experiences with Hanako. There's a velvet room here. Not that we need. We only have one spell card. Alright, and now it's time for the big room. Hey, who said you're allowed to spill the milk? That milk is good for you! And you gotta dr have to drink all you want! You should be happy, you gluttonous little porker! Now go on! Drink! Drink and drink some more! <laughs> and you, flies! What are you sticking your ass in the air like that for? It's only cast as a push-up when your whole body is close to the ground! If you keep doing it wrong, I'll have to give you more reps again! Ha 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 ha! Well, this is happening. I'm lactose intolerant! Oh gosh. I'm a thinking man! My brain is my strongest muscle! My arms simply aren't made to do push-ups! Toro and Smomu, what are you guys doing here? I thought you were both back at school. Please, stop! I beg you! I'm gonna die! Hey, don't pass out, Porky! You have to keep drinking! Think of yourself as a machine! An, an automaton made to consume milk. I can't move anymore. Oh gosh. Keep it up, dork! Don't lose it yet! It's Lady Michiko who will deal with you two in the end. If you break now, she'll definitely punish me for it. Oh no, they can't hold out much longer. We must do something about it now before it becomes too late. Wow, a fairy! I really saw it, Mom! Oh gosh. Huh? Y you go! You guys! Please save me! Uh, save these two goons? I wanna say no way, but like, why is Michiko doing this? There's some point I'm not getting. Oh, here we are. Here she is. <laughs> it's because they're hideous! And ugliness is unforgivable! Therefore, I, the acme of attractiveness, am punishing these sinners! Do you understand, whelps? <laughs> Who the hell do you think you are? You stuck a bitch! How dare you do this to a devil boy? Oh, there was a line there and you just crossed it! Cut this out and get those chains off of them right now! Oh, you care deeply for your friends, hmm? What a beautiful friendship, yes? <laughs> How splendid! Ha! Friendship! Then in honor of your admirable friendship, I'll tell you where the key is so you can free these ugly fellows from their chains. It can be found in the topmost floor of this tower. That's right, it's in my care! <laughs> if you wish to save your precious friends, come to me without delay! <laughs> Exit the door on your left and follow the path to reach my room in no time. However, those mirror shards you so eagerly seek, you may find one through the door behind me. The mirror shard kept with their large chest there, along with a hint to defeat me. <laughs> Remember, there's no time restriction in this tower. Spend as much time as you like searching. You only have to ask that your friends endure the torture a while longer. The choice is yours. I'll see you soon. Oh, great. Help me, please! Get that key quick! Where? Oh, what? Chain my okay. What are you doing? Stop slacking! <laughs> Go up that milk! Work those muscles! We've gotta help them. We we need that mirror shard too. What should we do? So can we talk to you? I'm only doing what Lady Mitchell ordered. If you have a problem, take it up with her. It's a good lesson for us too, though, don't you think? I mean, they're kind of lame. I mean, this is just. This is just wrong. So, we have a choice here. We can go to this door here, and it will take us to a mirror shard. But, 
We can also go straight to the boss. If you want all 12 mirror shards and you've been following along, you want to go straight to Michiko. You do not want to go to the left door. The right door. This door. Over here. If you go through this door, you will be unable to get all 12 mirror shards. So what we're going to do is I'm going to set up a save state. Because I actually have notes for the long version. <laughs> so we're going to do the long version now. And the next episode, we're going to do the short version. So I will be right back. I'm going to set up my save state. All right, now I set up my save state. We are going to go this way. And this should just take us straight to the fucking encounters. Straight to the encounters. Wow, nice instant kill. Rank 5 with sexy dance. And a Mazio stone. I'm fine with that. Yep, right to the stairs. Oh, God. Oh, wait, I remember those fucking birds. I remember you birds. Uh, well, shit. Well, we're in a spot here. Alright, we're gonna try and guns our way through here. Because I know these guys drain element and force. Oh, okay, they block. Never mind. That's just as bad. Oh, yep, I remember why I hate you guys so much. Guns go. Yep, I remember why they suck. They block element and force, and they have charm skills. Alright. So we want to go like this, ignore that pathway, and then we go into this darkness. Go east to like this. This, like this, east, and then there. And then run into an encounter immediately. Uh, you're carry, right? You're not. Like, I'm pretty sure Alice has a similar sprite to this one. But this is not Alice, this is Carrie. Because it would make no sense for Alice to be in Nemesis Tower. So besides, Alice is a rare encounter in like the final areas of the games. Alright, so... Oh my god! Oh, this is free. <laughs> More like instant death! Alright, level 34! Alright, let's see. So I'm gonna go long one. Three encounter. Zanma, nice mess. And now you're all dead. Ah, mail breaker, that's a weapon. I mean, we already have a Furba dagger. And the mail breaker sucks in comparison, so And boom, stairs. And then encounter. Okay, wow, this look at this. Look at this. This is free. Garu. And now like having cars are dead. And now they're all dead. Alright. Okay, wow, these paths feel so freaking easy. Oh boy! Hi! How you doing, Angel? I have Mudo. Your argument is invalid. This fight was over before it ever started. Goodbye. And now everything else dies. Dude, Ayasi's getting no chance to do anything. She's getting shafted hard. Uh... 
right, which way do we go? The door. Alright. Um, I remember you guys. You're the annoying enemies I don't like. Oh my goodness! Well, I remembered them! They were the annoying ones I hated so much! Well, shit. Dude, that heals like nothing. Alright, so we go this way, through a hole. And then down here, like this, through a hole. Alright, and then... Run into another encounter. Oh my god, why is this clusterfuck? I mean, we're still gonna, like, shred the f living fuck out of everything here. Case in point, literally shredded. Yet you, you know, gets the most experience, because, uh, of course... Encounters are so easy, it's not even funny. But this is the beauty of having done Thanatos Sour first. Another mail breaker. Another hole. Dude, at this rate, we might actually be able to just do the whole tower in one video! Like, this is sad! This is going way too well! I was expecting to do two videos for this. Wait, which way do we go? Okay. We should almost be there, actually. Like, literally already. Yo, at this rate, rank 7 with Dear Ama, not even bad. All right. Stairs. Uh. West. Wait, I went the wrong way. I'm going east. <laughs> I know my compass directions, clearly. This is east. This is west. Yep, there it is. That's the room. And we can see the starting room. And watch as everything that we run into just gets immediately slaughtered in like 13 seconds. I also level 31. Here we are! What the hell is this? Is this some kind of joke? Is this the chest Michiko referred to when it contains a mirror shard? Dear me, I didn't think finding our way here would be so strenuous. Dude, it was so easy! Ugh, am I gonna fall over and die if I have to move another inch? Who's that genius who said we should get a mirror shard? It turns out there isn't one in this chest. We can all this way for nothing. That would suck! That's a trap. No two ways about it, don't you think? So who gets to open it? I'm kinda shy. I don't time to take charge, so I'm gonna pass. Bitching and moaning about it won't do anything. Let's open her up. No, there's no real time on We still took a little too long. That's it. I'm tired. I have to rest. Mind if we take a short break? I'm quite worn out. Ah, I'm beat! Oh man, I don't want to think about walking back to the torture chamber. Well, we got our mirror shard. Huh? You spot a piece of paper in the corner of the chest. It appears to be a letter from Michiko. You open the letter. <laughs> so you reached this chest, have you? What a greedy bunch. It must have taken quite an endeavor. <laughs> you found what you sought, yes? Unlike you rotters, I keep my promises. And now, as promised, I'll reveal my weakness. I'm at my weakest. When you don't dawdle and get into me. <laughs> I do hope this helps. So by all means, hurry to my chamber. I'll be waiting. See you soon. From Michiko, with love. 
Jesus Christ. So yeah, the whole thing is a trap. So basically, if we want to get back to the torture chamber, I have a save state, so I really don't care about the time. Unfortunately, I will be missing out on these levels that I got from this place. Thinking about it now, I'm only like level 30, and when I did the Anto's Tower last in my first playthrough, I grinded my whole party to like low 40s to get through Thanatos Tower in my first Snow Queen run. And yet here we are, like level 30-ish, low 30s, and we are on the last tower. Which is just utterly hilarious, to be honest. Okay, so now we go this way and run to every encounter of the damn sun! God damn! I mean, it doesn't matter because Megadolion just breaks this game in half. Until the end game happens, at least. Alright. Um, wait. This way? Oh my god. That was my fault! Okay, well, there's an angel that so we have to use now in this fight. So we just click Mudo, and then everything else just gets slaughterfied. Goodbye. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> Thanks for the Malachite, pal. Alright. We don't want Naya to fight because he's overleveled. And everyone else just continues to spam their most broken attacks and then we just auto win every fight. Or we just one turn after one shot everything because, you know, of course. Wrong way. Oh my god. Like, it doesn't help that this is so easy! Nice. Goodbye. Like, it just doesn't help that we have this god combo that just makes everything a pushover. But yeah, you can see how going through all this is just a giant time sink. Which is the point. They want you to waste time in order for the boss to power up. Especially with the high encounter rate! I swear, this encounter is bad, but it's probably not as bad as another Persona game that I will probably eventually play in the future. Oh, trust me, it's... it's bad, but it's not nearly as bad as a certain other game that we're going to talk about in the eventual future. Oh boy, that one is bad. To the point where Estoma is practically your best friend. Alright, here we go, second floor. Um... Oh no. Really? I swear. Really? Well, that didn't matter. We still won. That was really ridiculous. Uh... Okay, go. I went the right way. Well, yeah, after this, we can just load up the save state, and literally, it's not even that far to the boss from the torture room. Especially with how overpowered we are. Level 30. Oh my god, you're only level 31. God, I'm looking forward to. Whoa, I keep doing that. What is wrong with me? Oh, hi, Angel. Goodbye, Angel. And goodbye, all of the other enemies, because you're literally all dead. Like, seriously? You're all dead. Goodbye. Okay, you just block. Doesn't matter. It didn't matter. Oh, and now you're leveled up. Level 42! Not like it matters! Because we are loading up the save state after this. Alright, so... Alright, we're going the right way. Wow, you actually managed to hit me. Goodbye. Okay. Janice, max rank! 
Now they're dead. Oh, Mazio stone. Why do I keep doing that? Jesus. Um, kill them. Oh, hi, Repel Ice. You know, we had a nice, fun experience with a, with a demon that repelled ice. And this should take us right into another encounter. You know what? Yeah, I think we can just do the whole damn tower in this one episode. Because let's be realistic here. We're just going to shred the boss in like eight seconds. So it's literally not even a big deal. Believe it or not, there is actually stuff in this town. Wait, which way am I going? Okay, this way. Oh, here we go! Garla. Uh-oh. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. Well, you know... It sounds like this. We have now ya to literally just press the nuke button and, you know, kill everyone. <sighs> Times like this, I'm glad we have now ya to click the nuke button. Alright, now that we're. <sighs> click the button. Thank you. And just like that! What?! Are you kidding me?! Oh god, it's these guys! Alright, well... Let's nuke him real quick. And then next turn, we're gonna have just spam guns. Oh no. Oh my god. Oh my goodness! Guns, go! There we go, easy fight! And here we are, back at the torture room! So, now that we got in the shard, what would happen if we didn't bother going all the way around and went just straight to the boss? Well, give me just a moment, I'm gonna roll my save state. So why do I cut to reload my save states? Well, you see, I don't know if it's gonna do something like fuck up my recording, so that's why. But anyway, the thing about this tower is we already know that depending on how long it takes you to get through, the boss will be stronger. But that's just it. Depending on how long it takes you, you may actually have to go further up. There is a treasure room higher up if you decide to waste time, but honestly, the items in it aren't even worth it. You really shouldn't even buy- Really now, I was in the middle of an exclamation game. Thank you. But anyway, we don't have the levels we got from the long path, so yeah, we're gonna have to just go through normal again. But yeah, it's not even worth it. Also, there's a treasure spring that we literally don't need. Guys, literally, we are going to shred the boss in like 20 seconds. Really? <laughs> Come on! Oh god. Blow him up. Oh god, it's Hanako. Good. Fuck Hanako. Yuki, though, they got the level. Well, 34. Alright, so we want to go like this, like this, and like this. And like that. And like this. For a treasure room. With Fuma's pain! The Gobate Shoes, if you really want to remake Ellie's starting persona. A Jubach Lance, which is for brown. And a Queen's Whip for Ayase. I mean, I think... Is that weapon better than Longinus? 
I mean, it raises our gun attack for some reason! And our defense and evasion, but it's still not worth. And this... sucks! Let's see, what about the Queen's weapon? SUCKS! Gotcha! Okay, good! Every weapon we got sucks balls! Gotcha! Can we hurry ahead with all possible haste? I can't shake this feeling. Having no time was even more ominous, so I think we should hurry on ahead. Hey, come on! There's no time in this tower, right? So let's take a break! We can get back along and get right to it! This tower is like totally creepy, you know? What's how you get through it? Yeah, that's how to get through. Oh my god! Go away, you annoying enemy! Wow, how did you not die? There we go. Alright! So we want to go back in the darkness, we'll go... Ow. Really? Okay, there it is. Really? Oh! Oh, you're one of those enemies! Why did you try to shoot yourself, Ayase? What the hell? Alright. So we go like this. Uh. Okay. Well, that was embarrassing. Uh, attack? Oh wait, there's you! Oh god damn, I forgot! <laughs> oh come on, stop! I also don't shoot yourself again. Okay, that works. Okay, so let's see. South. Step right. Okay, we're on the right track. And then... Last one. Okay, there we go. We made it. Okay! You know what? Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna do a fun little thing called Everyone Else is going to nuke everything? Except Brown, who's gonna fire his gun. There we go. Problem solved. That's how we do it. Alright. Let's go. 5F. Wait, hold on. Wait, what? Looking at my notes, we're literally at the end! Well, oh, come on! What the hell is this? Oh my god, repel fire! Oh, never mind, they're dead. Alright, guns go. I swear, putting Brown at the front it was a really good idea. Level 33. She still has a long way to go, though. Good 30 plus levels. So, here's the thing. If it took you below 20 minutes to get to the boss, the boss is right here. Straight up. So, let's see if we made it to the boss. No. Well, we have to go further. Wow, I can't believe it took me over 20 minutes. Alright, well then. Honestly, though? Wait, what? Oh, this is the boss! Never mind! <laughs> I'm sorry, I was wrong! Michigo Matsudaira, we're here for you! Give us the key to Free Toro and Sumomu. Could take it by force if that's the way you want to play it. That's what I plan anyway. I have a feeling you won't give up that easily, huh? I impossible! You're here so soon. What about the mirror shard? Did did you go get it? Oh, oh, how can this be? 
the source of my strength, the power of negative emotion. The hatred and anger is too weak. This won't be enough at all. Not only that, but... Why are these disgusting feelings that flow into me? Gratitude? Friendship? This is what those two are thinking as they're being tortured? <gasps> you couldn't have. You figured out how this tower works? No, simply impossible. My plans were flawless. Without exceptions, humans think, as long as I'm okay, others don't matter. This mindset. No, it's even more atavistic than that. It's instinct. My plans revolve around the basic human instinct for self-preservation. So why? Why? Why would you try to help others with no expectation of no reward? I can't understand at all. My strength. This level of power is far from adequate. What am I supposed to do? I never turn my back on my friends. It's bad for my rep, man. And I definitely never forgive a bitch like you. This is for torturing Tor and Sumomu. We're calling us all whelps. Well, most of all, we're saying I'm your pet. You're gonna pay royally for that one. Now let's get this show that started. And you know what? We don't even need all 12 mirror shards. Eight or so to do the job just fine. I never even know the game says that! What the fuck? <laughs> I never even knew! The game literally gives you no hint that you need at least eight shards. Until now, apparently. The more you know, I guess. I like, don't care too much about what happens to Toro Sumomo. But seeing a jerk like you act like some stuck-up celeb, now that totally pissed me off. Get it? <gasps> silence, silence, silence! Let me be clear on this. You're saying that I am inferior to that hideous pair? I, the lovely Michiko? Oh, oh, this is outrageous. My magnificent plans are simply too sophisticated for you managing curs. Oh, I knew I should have slain you all as soon as you entered this tower. Oh boy. Give in, Michiko. The more you squall, the more prominent your unsightliness becomes. You should see yourself in a mirror. <laughs> I for one be ashamed to look that way in public. Ayase is right. A failure to acquire a couple of mirror shots in this tower won't hurt a bit. Let's draw a line under this conversation, shall we? However much we explain it, you'll never understand our reason for coming directly here. Now, and guard! No! I won't succumb to the human heart! Kindness! Friendship! Trust! Such things simply do not exist in this world! I'll prove it to you with your defeat! Lord Nemesis, be the shield which protects me! Lord Nemesis, be the sword which vanquishes my foe! Heed my call! Go, Nemesis! Getting your persona out, huh? Okay, guys, battle stations. This one for Soho and Sumomu. Okay, this is her true form. So lovely! And so elegant! You've gotta be joking. I had enough of the fun in games already. I'm so disgusted I can barely speak. Like, have you ever even seen a mirror? You don't look like that at all! Scree! Silence, silence, silence! I'll slice this insolent face is right off! Alright, so Nemesis, the boss of Nemesis Tower, is weak to all weapons and guns, element, and nuclear! You literally have so many options to win against this fight, you can probably just spam Magadolion and auto, go grab a coffee or something, and you'll be done in like five minutes. Especially if you do the answer this tower first. So you know what? I'm not even gonna use personas! I'm so overpowered, we're literally just gonna fight with weapons. I don't even care. Here goes. Okay, wow, okay. You know change your plans. Watch use guns. That's doing no damage. I may have gotten a bit overconfident. Guns. Oh yeah, this will definitely end really fast. I mean, we have two seven-hit guns. Pat tries. Okay, you know what? Nope. Now we got. Now we're gonna stop playing games. She does have one very annoying skill called Revenge Leak. You know what? You can use guns. You can. Magarua, you can Persona, you can Persona, and you can Persona. Well, I mean... Okay, we have Bufalo, never mind. Yeah, you can use Personas. Persona. This fight should not be hard. At all. It's just that she probably has a lot of health considering this is the last hour. 
So yeah, I never actually mentioned the strength of the bosses is actually dependent on the order you do the towers. But it really only matters which one you do last as to which the persona is strong. Mazionine! But yeah, it really only depends on which tower you do last. And Nemesis' stats vary depending on how long you take. While Hypnosis' stats increase if you pinch Kumi in the Dream World. Thanatos is literally the same no matter what, except, you know, higher level. Thanatos is actually level 64 if you do his tower last. But yeah, this isn't hard. Like, outside of maybe Thanatos having Hell Eyes, none of these bosses are that ridiculous, as, unless you're doing the towers in difficulty order. With minimal grinding. But, you know, that's literally how it goes. This will take a bit longer because I'm not using Megadolion, just to be a bit more fair. Petra! Oh, come on! Kill yourself! I hope I have an item that can hear that. I don't. I have Somos. Oh, wait, no, I do. I have Disc Stones. Okay. Alright. There we go. But yeah, she hasn't even used Revenge Week yet. She's like her most dangerous skill. I'm actually curious how much experience I'm gonna get from this fight. Oh, don't you dare. Really? Dude, I just de-stoned him, and now you're gonna stone him again? I actually kind of want Brown to get experience from this fight, but no, you're just going to stone him continuously. But you're not even doing anything effective. Okay, I'm running out of SP, so we're just going to probably start Megadoleoning soon. Oh, never mind. Oh my god! Wow, of course now he gets the most experience! Welp, that's just what we need. More ridiculous level ups. Level 42, Jesus Christ. I could make Almond Ra if I really wanted to, because I'm gonna have to farm anyway. I mean, that's like level 31! Hmm. Game, set, and match. Do you want to go another few rounds? I... I lost? Unbelievable! Inconceivable! And to a pack of fruit delinquents, no less! Oh, how could this be? Oh, God. SHUT THE HELL UP! You got a beatdown for me, the always amazing Brown, and his gang! Is that gang through to you? So stop horking like a seal and get out of my sight! Please? <laughs> yep, that's right. You're like totally hopelessly stupid. I'm sick of looking at your stupid face. Will you just get out of here? Like, now? <laughs> what matter of egotistical abhorrent monsters are you? I've done nothing yet the five of you gang up on me, and then gloat in triumph! People are always like that. You lot are no exception. And neither are those ugly faces on the walls who once seamlessly senselessly bullied me. Don't you understand? All I do is leverage my vast wealth to land the role of the Snow Queen. What? And also have that floozy hanging around my bow in the drama club expelled. And bribe the teachers to lift my grade slightly more towards acceptability. But those more to my class. They called me names. They talked behind my back. They gave me the cold shoulder. Only the Snow Queen mask ever extended a helping hand to me. That's right, it and no one else. Only the mask understood my profound sorrow, my wretched circumstances. Tell me, where right does anyone have to pick on poor little me? I certainly can't understand. What? Excuse me, princess? Is this really why you abandoned the real world to be a mini of the Snow Queen? Unbelievable. You've gone completely around the twist. You continue to mock me even after knowing my heart-rending past? Yes! Screw you! I can't believe this! I've had enough. I suppose it was entirely too much to ask. How could you, the poor in spirit, understand my sorrow? Hmm. Fine. I'll give you a win this once. 
But I warn you, in due time the thirst for revenge churning in me will be denied no more. And on that day, I shall once again give you hell. Remember that! I'll stand in your way again and again! Do I look, do look forward to it? Until then, farewell! Please, for the love of God, never again. Goodbye. Well, we got a mirror shard, and for completing this hour last, we obtained one more Ambrosia. <laughs> I never see her again, it'll be too soon. Oh, hey, I wonder if Toro and Sumobu are okay. Stupid Michiko, she didn't even give us the key. Shaka, once we get back to school. Come on, let's go. You have conquered Nemesis Tower! Hey, it's back to Devil's Peak. So now that we've completed all three towers, we can go and challenge. The Snow Queen mask right now. But we're not gonna do that yet. Because first, we're going to not do it yet, because reasons. But first, let's go see Toro and Simone real quick before we end the episode. Ow, my arms are so sore, I can't even lift them. <laughs> Wait, what? Wait, hold on. Hold your fucking horses. Why do these things always happen to me? Oh, I almost forgot. Someone told me to give this to you. Whenever me were coming back from the tower, we found this shiny thing. But his muscles hurt so bad they couldn't hold it. So I'm giving it to you in his place. Shards. Two mirror shards, and with that, we have a completed mirror frame with twelve shards. So, ha by having all twelve shards, after we challenge the Snow Green Mask, we will be obtaining a special armor that is exclusive to Daria because of fucking course it is. But anyway. We are going to be showing off the bad ending, because of course there's one, next time. And that requires me to play all three towers over again, because yeah, of course. Watch it, we, we have extra files. So, next time, what happens if we go into the boss battle with less than eight mirror shards? We will find out, and I'll see you then.